This video supplements our article on bi-invariant generalized barycentric coordinates for scattered sets of points in arbitrarily groups. We start with an example in the Euclidean plane. The points indicated in red make up the scattered set. The point in green is where we evaluate the barycentric coordinate. The decimal numbers indicate the result of this computation, namely the entries of the barycentric coordinate, also referred to as weights. The weights always sum up to 1. When the point of evaluation approaches a point from the scattered set, the corresponding weight converges to 1. Barycentric coordinates can be used for classification. The label at any location is simply the label of the points in the scattered set with the greatest accumulated weights. Instead of the Euclidean plane, here we consider the nonlinear three-dimensional Lie group SE2. Points in the group are visualized by arrowheads at a xy location in the plane, as well as an angular orientation. No distance function that is invariant under all group actions exists on this Lie group. The contribution of our article is to define barycentric coordinates on Lie groups without bi-invariant distance function. Because the resulting barycentric coordinates still capture the notion of proximity, the coordinates can be used for classification tasks. The term bi-invariance means that the barycentric coordinate evaluation is invariant under left action and right action by an arbitrary group element, as well as inversion of the points. The animation shows such equivalent configurations of points that leave the weights constant. Our coordinate construction also works in certain homogeneous spaces, for instance, the d-dimensional sphere and the space of symmetric positive definite matrices. Lie groups are a subset in the set of homogeneous spaces. Barycentric coordinates can be used to define smooth deformations, as illustrated here on the two-dimensional sphere. The deformation is determined by the shift of the six anchor points. When a barycentric coordinate function in one Lie group is combined with a weighted average in another, the result is a smooth interpolatory function from one Lie group into the other. The function is invariant under all available group transformations and symmetries. Our construction of bi-invariant generalized barycentric coordinates makes use of the results on weighted averages on Lie groups by Penek and Arseny. Barycentric coordinates are an inverse of the weighted average. The evaluation of coordinates that we propose requires the computation of tangent vectors as well as the null space of a matrix and its pseudo-inverse. The displayed code in Mathematica is specific to the Euclidean vector space. In the future, we plan to investigate weighted averages and barycentric coordinates on general homogeneous spaces. Also, we plan to study how barycentric coordinates on Lie groups fare in engineering applications, for instance in robotics. Our article as well as the source code are available online. Thank you for watching.